start your training session off with a bunch of high reward yet tasty treats. Begin for a blind and deaf dog with a treat in your hand. Put the treat close to the dog's nose and make sure you can touch underneath the dog's chin. Slightly pull the treat and your hand back, but very slightly pull your fingers against the dog's chin at the same time. The dog will want to follow the treat. At first, only do short distances, but over time, increase the distance so the dog has to walk longer and further. Eventually, you will be able to take the treat away and use the touch signal of pulling your fingers along the dog's chin. Don't forget your positive marker as well. For a deaf dog, start with the treat in your hand and choose your come signal. Once the dog comes over to you, give the positive marker and the treat right away. You can incorporate your touch signal like I did for Tink's come signal. Start rather close to your dog so they can get the hang of what you are trying to get them to do. You may have to use the treat to lure them the first few times. Over time, increase the distance so your dog has to travel further to get to you. Always make sure the come command is positive and fun so your dog will want to come to you. For doing the come command from a distance, get creative. Blow on your blind and deaf dog or use a light flicker to get a deaf dog's attention. Just because a dog can't see or hear doesn't mean they can't get a distance recall.